Okay, hello YouTube, and today I'm doing a quick video, or oh, something quick, but a, a video on Make Human. This is version, I think it's 1.51 1 or something like that. It's the Alpha.1, I did a video on it yesterday. I'll put up the link for the for the main page for it, or you can just search Google. But um, I'm just going to go through uh, what you can do on it. Well, first off, well, yeah, the basic settings and stuff. So first off is uh, when you go in, when you slide up, as you see this, uh, gender. Now slide it to the right for male, left female, and anywhere in between is like, I think it's an hermaphrodite, I don't know. Age, self-explanatory, higher you go, the older, maxing at 70, younger, to the left, younger, maxing at 12. Uh, we're going to go about, what's that, 26. So now let's go. Let's go 70, never done an old bloke. Tone, this refers to muscle tone. Higher it is, the more muscle. Lower it is, the less muscle. And um, all these options can be seen down here. So, uh, yeah. Let's go full muscle man, full muscle old man. And uh, weight, to the right, you go um, plus at plus fifty percent to the left it's minus fifty percent it's fifty percent so let's go uh weight hundred and fifty percent height very very big now uh details obviously there's this tool it does what it says I wanna minimize that now these two sliders here are only affected if you have um, anything besides 100% male. So uh, yeah, face tool. This just um, face cam. There we go. This just modifies how the person's nose look. There's a variety of presets. I'm gonna go with that hook shape nose, mouth shape. My blokes could be sad face. Eyes. Uh, that was a really good one here somewhere. I think that was it there. Yeah, that's about it. It's like hawk kind of eyes. There's ears. And I want to go the elf looking, the most elf looking ear. Then there's jaw shape. You can see the teeth going. Oh, you could, but changes. I'm just going to go default. Doesn't matter to me that much. Finishing, there's nothing in finishing unless they're supposed to be. I don't know, it could be a glitch. Hair. Hang on. Oh, sorry. Uh, hair detail. The, um, the hair in this uh, Make Human is unfinished, and in that, it's very unreliable and kind of pointless. Now, um,. Sorry about that if you had your, uh, what's he, speakers up. Oh, could have just blown your speakers, I don't know. Oh, now, um, in files, there's save, load, export, pretty self-explanatory. Save, we'll call this, uh, huge old man. And, uh, click save. Then we'll return you to modeling, and you just go file, load. There's huge old man there. And then there's my midget crow man over there. Now uh, there's export, which is probably one of the best features in this. Dot object, dot obg, exports as object without um any of the armatures or anything. And there's dot mhx, which is the blender uh, export uh, file type. And these three, I don't know what they do. I know dot dae is fairly common, but I've never seen md5. And uh, hair as mesh as curves. As long as you don't have hair, doesn't matter. Now libraries, there's a few options there. Background doesn't. Really, these two don't really matter. But uh, advanced. 
this just changes uh, like uh, asymmetry. I'm assuming how um, Ctrl Z. I'm assuming that's uh, how symmetrical the face is. So to the right means it's more increased on the right. To the left, it's more increased on the left. And there's a few options there. Measure. This just gives you more control over your person. You can make their neck bigger or smaller. I'm going to pump up all the options just to see what happens. Because my man's going to be the humongous man. So it doesn't matter to me what he looks like. It's probably going to look like a freak after this, but... Eh, who gives a crap here? So to the right increases, to the left decreases. Now let's see what it looks like. Very, very, very big and weird. But hey, we're going to keep him. Now, uh, there's experimental here. There's hair, as I said, is useless. I'm not even going to bother showing you it. All you're going to do is create hair. Strands number, amount of hair he has, strand length, how long it is, control points. Don't understand what control points is and gravity factor, how much it falls over. Then there's this avoid collision, which means I won't go into the mesh and just create hair or delete hair. Pose. I'm not sure how you change what thing it's posing, but uh, anyway. Uh, render pretty much just renders it out. Just go run, I think. Hmm. Okay, for some reason the render didn't work since the lookup error no codec search functions registered. So I don't know. Settings, there's a no shader, fong shader, tune shader, skin shader. Skin shader looks really weird. So I'm gonna go no shader. Then I'm gonna go save and uh files export .mhx the Biggest man you will ever see. Yes, I know it's all one word. You don't have to have it like that. And in the uh, Make Human Python window, in a second it'll start going crazy and just add lots of crap in. And that one's actually pretty quick. Now I don't know how to add clothes. There's no options to tell you how to that show you how to make clothes or excuse me, even clothes up here. I don't know, but um, yeah. Thanks for watching this video. I probably took up like ten minutes of your time. I'm a bit shy of ten minutes, probably about nine thirty nine minutes. But um, thanks for watching this uh, video, and uh, yeah, thanks. Oh, one sec, I'll show you something quickly. Now the files you export go into documents uh, make human exports and then there'll be a slash 25.mhx dot object dot dae dot what was the other one md5 and they come out about 5 5 meg 5 meg or 4 meg so um yeah thanks for watching this video and uh bye